Hey all my sparkles. So today I'm so excited because I am going to do a living like it's the 90s for 24 hours. And I love the 90s so I was like I definitely want to do this challenge. And um, you can already tell that I have my um, hair already did and my 90s outfit on. But you will all see that in the video later of how I you know put that together. And yeah so I'm so excited to do this challenge and anyone knows me knows i love the 90s so i'm definitely a 90s kid and also this is my first ever 24 hour challenge so i'm so excited and also you will see some pictures throughout the video of me you know when i was a kid in the 90s so definitely look out for that if you all want to see me do this challenge for 24 hours living like it's the 90s then just keep on watching and here's the happy meal i got from mcdonald's and i chose mcdonald's because that's one of the places i would definitely go and get happy meals when i was like a little kid in the 90s so i'm so excited to have this and okay i'll show you what i got okay so okay this is the toy they gave me all right oh, cute Yeah, I just remember I always always be so excited for the toys when I was younger. In there. Okay, I got some fries. So I have some fries right here. And also I didn't want any apple slices, so I just told them that they replace it with another fry. And also they ended up giving me an apple pie. I guess because they forgot to you know put this fry in there first so they gave me apple pie and yeah I really don't eat apple pies that much so I'm gonna give it to my grandma and let's see I got a six piece chicken nugget and also I got this fruitopia because if you know, I remember in the 90s they definitely had fruitopia but I didn't really start drinking fruitopia at like the early 2000s but it's definitely one of my favorite from the 90s. And also I used to drink, you know, Spark too, but I love Fruitopia. And I am going to eat this food and enjoy my meal. And I will see you all later. And also they didn't have any barbecue sauce, but I'm just going to find some barbecue sauce, you know, here at the house and eat with my chicken nuggets. All right, so I will see you all later. So now it's time to get ready and here are all here are all the things I'm gonna wear today and I'm so excited. I have my rollerball lip gloss. This one is from ColourPop. And also I have this nail polish that my aunt she bought for me back in the 90s. So this is actually from the 90s. This nail polish. And I'm wearing it on my nails right now. And of course we have some butterfly clips because everybody in the 90s, the 90s kids, we were wearing these butterfly clips. And I also have some earrings that I wore when I was a little kid. And remember these um, rings and they also they move. How cute is those rings? I remember I had butterfly rings as well that move and had glitter on it. And I have this choker necklace because I definitely love wearing chokers in the 90s. So let's get ready with me. Let's get ready with me. This is you getting you all getting ready with me in the 90s. So, yes, I'm so excited. All right, so first, I already put my hair in pigtails off camera. I just put like, you know, my little hair ties right here and I tied it into pigtails and I haven't had pigtails in so long. So, this is it very nostalgic for me. So, I'm so excited about this. All right, so I am first before I do that, I'm gonna put my choker necklace on and if you watch like my videos throughout the years you will notice this choker and I love wearing this choker necklace and you can definitely can catch it actually my first YouTube video ever so I definitely will link that in the description box below if you want to check that out so now I'm gonna put this on and I'll be right back okay so got my choker on and like I love these chokers and actually these chokers are came back into like style because before I remember it went away but it came back again so excited about that okay so now I'm gonna put my earrings in and how cute are these earrings and like I said I had these ever since I was little and I haven't worn 
some scents. So I'm so excited to put these on. And of course, I have my mirror right here. I'm looking in. Okay, I have one in right here. Now, here's the next one. Okay, so I have my earrings in, and it definitely matches my choker necklace. And I'll put my other ring on. So now let's put the butterfly clips on and I'm going to show you all these butterfly clips and they definitely bring back so many memories. So awesome. Okay, so let's put on these butterfly clips. I'm going to put them all throughout my bangs as well. Just a to have some butterfly clips in there. So what was, I want to know in the comments below, what was like some of your favorite 90s hair accessories and like lip gloss, lip, lip balm? Let me know in the comments below because I would love to know. What were all my subscribers wearing? Um, it's like, you know, hairstyles in the 90s. Love to know. Okay, let's see. Yeah. Okay. Just to add some throughout my hair, and wow, this brings back so many memories. Take this purple one right here and add it right here and add this yellow one right here. Okay. Oh my goodness, this is so cute. How cute is this? Isn't that cute? All right, so I have my hair, my hair, um, and my butterfly clips. And it looks so cute, and it looks. I definitely was wearing pigtails in the '90s, and yeah, I definitely love wearing pigtails, and I love wearing a lot of other hairstyles as well. But you know, pigtails as well. So I was so excited to recreate a pigtail look that I, you know, used to do in the '90s. I definitely added butterfly clips in my hair. So yeah. So now let's get into, also I'm going to add my little firefly ring. I'm going to put this on a pinky finger. I have it right here. Do you remember these rings? It's so cute and it, and it shakes you. Aww. <laughs> okay. 
So I already have my nail polish on, as you can tell right here. And like I said, I love the ice cream cone. And my aunt, like I said, she bought me this in the 90s. I think it's for a Christmas gift. And I just love it. And I have it on right now. Okay, so last but not least, now we're going to the Rollerball Lip Gloss. Okay, so if you all remember these Rollerball Lip Glosses, these are so cute. I love Rollerball Lip Glosses, especially during the 90s. I ended up getting this ColourPop Lip Gloss, and this is the ColourPop Land, and this is from the, the Candyland collection from ColourPop. And I had to get this because, you know, I love Rollerball Lip Glosses. And also, I got this lip gloss, and this is from Italian Deluxe lip gloss and yeah so now I have to choose which one to wear um this is hard to choose so let's see mm. so which one do you think I should wear mommy the darkest one the darkest one yeah okay so the cherry flavor yeah okay so we're gonna go with the cherry flavor okay so let's put on this roll lip gloss mmm it smells like cherry it brings me back to my childhood. I remember I just love going to like the hair store and they would have these there and I would get them. And you remember, we tried to collect a lot of them, like the um, orange and then lime and the grape and cherry. Mm, loves it. And it makes, this smells just like sweet tarts. And yes, it smells so good. And I love it too. Nice shine. Okay, so we're all ready for the 90s. Got my outfit, and I will show you all my outfit, but I just want to show you all, you know, me getting ready, and, and I want to show you all my outfit now. Okay, so my shirt I got from Box Lunch, and it's an awesome site where they show a lot of Nickelodeon, Disney, all that kind of stuff. Like, they have hoodies shirts and I got this shirt so I'm so excited because I love Hey Arnold and this definitely is the 90s because anybody who's from the 90s remember like you know Hey Arnold so this is the Jolly Ice Cream Ollie shirt and I love it because I love ice cream and I love blue and it's so nice and comfy as well and so also I got these jeans they're from Kato's and I definitely shopped at Kato's in the 90s I love Kato's and I didn't wear ripped jeans in the 90s, but I know it was a 90s trend, so I definitely, you know, had to put that in there. And also, I have these um, clog shoes on, and these are my grandma's shoes, but I remember in the 90s, I used to wear a lot of these clog shoes like this. And you also can catch these shoes in my spring 2015 video I did, so I'll leave that in the description box below as well. And I love these shoes, and also I painted my toenails the same color I painted my nails. With that ice cream nail polish and yeah and i remember a lot of people used to wear these clogged shoes like um american ashley um britney spears beyonce so yeah and that is my outfit but also you see how i did my lip my lip gloss and also how i did my hair so yeah i just want to show you all my 90s inspired outfit Also, I can't forget my Miss Piggy purse that my grandma, she bought me when I was little. How cute. I'm going to put something in here probably um, later. And yeah, here's my little purse. It is so cute. And this is what it looks like up close. I remember I was so excited when I was little when I, when I got this. Yep, and I still have it. Okay, so now let's go and take some Polaroid pictures. Okay, so now I am going to take some Polaroid pictures. And here is my Barbie camera that I had the 90s and I'm so excited to use this because I haven't used it since I was like 9 or 10 years old and also I have some Polaroid film and I got this because of course you can't get like the Barbie Polaroid anymore so I just got this film and I haven't like you know took a Polaroid picture in so long probably like 19 years I guess 
but I'm excited to take some right now. So here we go. Okay, so okay, so my grandma she took a picture of my outfit. So this is like my first Polaroid I ever took since like probably like 19 years. So it's still de developing right now. So I have to wait for it to finish. And I'm gonna take some pictures throughout the day, and I'll let you see it at the end of the video. So yes, so I'm excited, and like I said, it's still developing. So yep. But I just want to show you all, you know the Polaroid and whenever it's finished like I said at the end I'll show you know after it's finished developing okay so now I'll show you the rest of what I'm doing today okay so now I just want to show you all some of the you know supplies that us 90s kids had in like the 90s so I'm so excited to show you all this and okay so the first thing I have here are milky gel pens and I remember I used to use these all the time, especially, you know, when I was at the house or, you know, in school sometime, like when I just want to, you know, draw, write in my little planner. I remember I used to love these milky gel pens. And if you all remember these, comment this below in the description, in the comment section and just let me know if you all remember these. And actually, if you look at my 90s kids video, I had these in there. So... I got these from, I want to say, I think I got these from Michaels, but when I find out, I'll leave in the description box below. Definitely recommend these because I love these Milky Gel pens and I was so excited when, you know, they brought them back. And also, I cannot forget about Lisa Frank and I definitely had a lot of Lisa Frank products in the 90s and I'll show you some right here. This is my Lisa Frank planner that I had when I was in third grade and how cute is that i remember so many girls love to get lisa frank's um products and yeah i have some information right here i'm gonna cover that up right here but yeah how cute is these planners and i remember i used to ask like all my classmates and um they were right in here and you yeah, just have so many great memories and some stickers too i had in here so it's so great to look through my planner and everything happened on here 2000 and then 2001 okay yes so nostalgic and this was like a close okay so I just want to show you all that and also I got this official milky gear note cube and I had a lot of this like in the 90s this um, black paper and you can write on it with your milky gel pens and now I remember I went on eBay because I really wanted to get one so I was like you know what I just want to get one and it's this has never been used and I was like I definitely need to get this so I'm gonna open this on camera and I'm gonna write with my milky gel pens I'm gonna write a message for my subscribers and then at the end of the video I will open it on camera and you will see what I wrote all of my subscribers so yes so let me also I got these notebooks whenever um, I went to South University when I um, got my master's degree in business administration so I had these they were Lisa Frank and I was so excited to get them so I had to include this in my video as well because yeah, like I said, I still love Lisa Frank products and also look at this, this diary. Um, I found this like, I want to say five years ago and I was so excited. I found this from like my childhood and I had a lot of cute things I wrote in here and it's so sweet. And also look what I found. Now I found this picture of me and my grandma. I was seven and she was 58. And I stick, like this picture, you know, it's like it fell out this, mm. okay, so this picture fell out, but I'm going to glue it back in here, but how cute, let's kind of get a close up of it, hold on, here's the picture of me, no seven, and I had all my Winnie the Pooh backpack, my Teletubby, and I had my bees, and here's the picture of my grandma, how cute is she, and we was on vacation in Virginia, and I just remember, I think my brother hates a picture of us. So yeah, I just want to show you all that. And yeah, so like I said, I'm going to write a message for my subscribers. And also I have these Lisa Frank envelopes. 
and I found these like in my room and how cute are they look at the back of them so like I said I am oh I want to show you this other picture I found in my room also I found this picture of me and my cousin and also it's this other person in here I don't remember her name I don't, but she you know I guess came to our church she came to visit us and yeah there's a picture of us with my Barbie camera I took okay writing and now I'm writing my subscribers a message okay also I want to do those um, fortune tellers you all remember those fortune tellers um, in school when you just like you pick a number and obviously you know what it is and then you say okay I pick red and they have like a little um, message in there I really want to do that as well so I'm going to do that and I'll show you all when I get finished Okay, I'm opening this cube. Okay, cute. Okay, oh yeah. Oh, that's really cute. That's a lot of black paper right here. It has a facial milky year. Okay. And this would look like so I'm excited to write on this as well all right so let's get to writing
to finish eating dinner and I just been you know just relaxing and I was thinking you know I just need a snack so I got me chicken Duncan's Lunchables and I love Lunchables if any of y'all remember um from the 90s remember it used to be like a big box and it used to have like a almost like a soda can and I'm gonna show if I can find a picture I'll put it up right here and I remember I was so excited for these Lunchables like of course I have them for dinner or a snack so today I'm just gonna have it for a snack and I'm so excited to have this they're always so good to me you know to eat those Lunchables and shout out to Lunchables if you're watching this video hi <laughs> okay so let's open up this Lunchable I had chicken nuggets earlier and you see my McDonald's Happy Meal and also I had chicken and soup earlier as well so I just want to touch on that so ooh so excited okay so here are the chicken nuggets and it's like ketchup in here and some nerds and I love nerds and this is what it looks like and also have a Capri Sun here. This is a Fruit Punch Capri Sun. Love Capri Sun as well. All right. So let's open this up and I'll have my snack. Oh, these are the strawberry nerds. Mm-hmm. Okay. Have my ketchup here. I want to warm up my chicken nuggets. And so I'm going to put them in a plate and warm them up. And I'll be right back. All right. So I warmed up my chicken nuggets in a microwave. You can see the steam coming out, too. Mm. Smells really good. Really good. Also, I have my ketchup here. And yeah, let me open up this Capri Sun. What am I going to listen to? Everybody, Father, thank you for this food I'm going to receive today. Thank you for the people who prepared this food for me. And just name I pray. Amen. Amen. Tasting the fruit punch. Mm. So good. It's just like I always remembered it. Which I've had Capri Suns, you know, since well after my childhood, but I was just saying it tastes so good. Okay. They're hot. Okay. Mmm. Okay, it's good. Mm. So I'm going to finish eating the rest of these and I'll be back and I'll have the rest of my snacks. They're so delicious. So good. Alright, so I finished eating those chicken nuggets. They were so delicious. I love the chicken nuggets. And now I'm going to open up these nerds. I've had these in so long. Maybe the strawberry time. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna show you. This is what I used to do. Like I remember, I used to have like the bigger nerd candies, like you know, the bigger box. And I so also used to get like these smaller ones. They used to get in the Lunchables. And I remember with these small ones, these this is how I used to eat my <laughs> my nerds. I used to do like this. <laughs> Mm. This definitely brings back my childhood. I used to buy these so much. I usually do it. I used to eat them like this, or I used to pour my hand. Mostly, I used to do it like this with this little box. Mm. Mm. So good. I have a 
little bit left. I eat this later. And I want to open up these sweet tarts. And sweet tarts are so good. And I'm ready to remember those sweet tarts that have like the little green paper that like individually wrapped. And um, of course, I used to get those as well. But I also love these big boxes. I'm so good. Okay. All right. I have my sweet tarts right here in my hands. Mm. These candies and all these snacks are definitely bringing back to my childhood. I know you like sweet tarts too. Yep. Mm -hmm. I love them. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's enough. That's enough? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. It's so good and sweet. Mm hmm. It's some old stuff, girl. Uh, yeah, it's a long time ago. Remember, I used to eat them all the time. Yep. You used to buy them, buy them, buy them. Mm hmm. And just eating that candy mm -hmm. and those sweets definitely brings me back to when I was a little kid. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like, I was seven or six years old. Not a lot of sugar in it. Yeah, that's true. That is true. Okay, so I had my candy. I had my Lunchables. Now let's go to the frozen treats. And I love popsicles. I used to eat popsicles all the time. I still do, just so you know. <laughs> but um, I'm going to show you all the popsicles. All right, so I have my... I have my popsicle here, and these are the popsicles that comes in the box, like with all three colors, the red, orange, and grape, and the ice pops, and I love these. I see them all the time. And I have the cherry flavor, and it's like my favorite. I love the cherry kind. I love all of them, especially cherry flavor. So I have my popsicle right here. I should show the camera more. So nice and so refreshing. Mm. I just love it. Popsicles. Okay, so I just want to show you all my snacks from the 90s that I enjoyed growing up. And I guess I'm going to eat this off camera and then I'll show you what else I'm going to do today. Okay, so right now... Me and my grandma, we're going to play Mancala, and I'm so excited to play this game. I haven't played this in so long, but I remember we always enjoyed playing this game and her together, and it's so fun to play, and I definitely recommend playing this game with your family or anybody, like your friends, anybody you want to, I just definitely recommend this game. It's so much fun, so let's play this game. I'll show you what it looks like if anybody haven't seen it before. Okay. Okay, so this is what it looks like. It's like a wooden board. And here's the marbles. And you just put all, you put the marbles in here. You put all of them like equal. And gemstone then, playing pieces. Yes, your gemstone. gemstone. Oh, okay. Yep. And you just drop them in here. And then you um, pick them up, drop them, drop them. And then pick up some more. Who feels the most first wins? That's what it's like. And yeah, so we're so excited to play them. All right, so let's play. All right.
said you're going to win, don't you, girl? I got you. I got you. I'm going to get you, girl. Oh, my goodness. I'm going to get you. I am going to get you. We're having so much fun. Hope y'all okay. hope y'all enjoying this video. Yeah, because I'm gonna get her. We'll see, we'll see. We're gonna see about it. We'll see. I'm on the roll, girl. Yes, ma'am. Mm -hmm. Oh, my side thing you got on yours, honey child. I'm gonna get you. Okay. Keep throwing them out there. <laughs> I'm gonna get you. Uh huh. Okay, let's see, girl. Mm hmm. Let's go back here. I'm gonna eliminate you, girl. That's right, keep putting them over here. <laughs> oh. Oh, <laughs> I'm going to eliminate you. That's what I'm going to do. Mm -hmm. Give you very little to work with, girl. Uh, Just keep going. Uh, you finished? Mm -hmm. Okay. This one, you're some. Oh. All of you. Keep going. Uh huh. Mm. Okie dokie. Mm. Oh my goodness. Keep rolling. I'll give you nothing to work with, girl. Uh huh. Keep rolling. <sighs> Come on, come on. Come on. Oh. Uh huh. My. This man. It's on your side. Uh -huh. Okay, good. Thank you. Uh huh. Mm. I go on your side, girl. I told you I was going to annihilate you, didn't I? No. I am going to get you, girl. I want to win. You can't win with me. I want it so I can go so bad. Can't win. I gotcha. I gotcha. Uh huh. I gotcha, girl. I gotcha. We are clear some more side. Huh? We are clear some most, I guess, on this side. Or Whoever got the most in this cup. Yeah, in this, this, in this cup. I gotcha. Go ahead. Oh, you can't do but one thing or two. I got okay. you. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, girl. Mm -hmm. Girly girl. Oh, this is keep cool. rolling. That's all you can do. That's the best you can do, huh? Uh huh. That's the best you know how to do. Mm-hmm. You're done. I feel that. I won. You done, though. I'm done. No. <laughs> but I finished the verse. I finished first. I Th thought this was yours. Uh-uh. This is, this is my as well. Oh. So, I mean, I have more than you have. Yeah, let's count. But I finished it first. Okay, let's count. Let's count. Girl. Let's count, it, girl. Okay. I got 15. One, two, three, 15 of those bad boys. 15 six, of those seven, bad boys. Eight, nine, ten, 
I have 17. Oh, so you won. Yes, I won. Like, yes, I won. I won. Okay. But we have fun. Yep. And y'all got to see us play this. And we had a great time. It's been like, how many, Mo? How many? Well, probably been like, mm, I want to say like 15, 16 years since we played this game. But it's been fun to play this game. And we're going to play this game more often. You know, mm -hmm. play some more of these board games and games. So it's always mm -hmm. fun to do. Just like, you know, put your cell phone down and just have family game night. Mm -hmm. And we're going to try to start doing that too. Play some games. Yes, yeah, so hope you guys enjoy seeing me play these games. And also, I'm going to show you all another game I'm going to play. So, yeah. So, yes, we did it. Play this game. Fun. Yes, it we're all winners here, though. Uh -huh. We're all winners. But I did win this game. <laughs> okay, love you. Love you too. Love you more. More, more. Okay, and now it's time to listen to some music and play some video games. Okay, so now I am going to listen to some music and I have my CD player. And yes, I'm so excited to listen to some music and. Yeah, I plugged up my um, video now headphones on here. So yeah, and this is from the company Disc Digital Audio. Anybody remember those? That company. Okay, and also I have my first CD, which is the Whitney Houston CD. This is not a CD case that came in, but I think it broke, so my dad put it in this case, CD case for me. And I still have like the booklet, and it's my first CD ever. It was Whitney Houston, My Love Is Your Love. So here it is right here. And I had like great memories listening to this CD. And this is what it looks like. And here's the back. And kind of just like different pictures. And um, yeah, so I'm so excited to listen to this again. And yes, great memories. Alright, so I'm gonna put in my CD player and then put the CD in. all the way back like this but I'm gonna listen to it like this <laughs> let's see what song I want to okay I listen to my love is your love so that's number three so good to listen to her CD and yes I definitely enjoyed listening to it I'm going to switch some more later so good to hear the CD because I haven't listened in so long so right now I want to play this Game Boy and I love this game so much and I had so many great memories playing it so let's cut this on right now okay and I have my Spectre Gadget game in here and let's play it right now. Okay, so. And also I have this uh, Rugrats Time Travelers Game Boy Color game. Also enjoyed playing this as well. I'll play, um, play that later as well. Okay. And let me know in the comments below what is your favorite um, games from the 90s? Any like board games or um, game systems? Anything like that? 
If you have the Game Boy Color, let me know as well too in the comments below. Okay, this is fun. All right, well, I'm going to play the rest of this. I just want to play a little bit and just, you know, have some fond memories of it just playing that. Okay, so I found some of my favorite books from the 90s and I have this Barney Protect Our Earth book and I haven't seen this book since I was, hmm, I want to say maybe seven or six, but yeah, I have it and I haven't looked through it, you know, the book since then, so it's just so awesome just to look at it. Let's see. Oh, and it was like stickers and like if you pull this off right here, it was so easy to pull off and it, you could stick it right back on there. Let's see, let's see, right here, and stick it right back. And it's so cute and I remember I used to read this all the time. And here's the other one. Okay, so I just want to look through book and also like one of my favorite books was some um michael jordan in space sham look and find book and this came out right when the time the movie came out and i was so excited to get this book and i'll read it all the time and let's see, no, no. this is what it looks like and it was just mostly just a lot of different pictures and you have to find like the characters from the movie in here and have a nice like little story in here and yes i would just look through them in all circle and find all the characters in here and yeah so I'm, right now i'm gonna just look through this book and i'll be back and just read it and reminisce on the movie and this book <laughs> I'll be back okay so I'm back and now I want to show you all some of my you know toys from the 90s which I had a lot of toys from the 90s and of course in early 2000s but I just want to show you all some right here now how many of y'all remember these Pokemon toys you got in the Happy Meal especially like at Burger King and I remember me and my brother we tried to collect all of them and Here's this cute like, little toy from Pokemon toy. It's like a spinny top. I uh, can't do it right here, but but yeah, it's so nice. And I remember we tried to collect all of them. And one day I will probably show you all my Pokemon collection. That'd be so much fun to show on camera. It's like a throwback to the 90s. So one day I'll do that. And also like one of my favorites. And so one of my favorites is this Polly Pocket Star. And it's so cute. And I, it had like lights in here. Mm, okay. So this is what it looks like inside. And if you look at my 90s kids video, you can, I remember I mentioned about it in here. And I used to have so much fun playing with this toy. I have like this little doll. Look how tiny this is. How cute. This little baby in here. I used to have so much fun. It's kind of Oh yeah, it's a, let's see, if I can show you all. Move up and down. Oops. But yeah, it had like little parts, so you put like little dolls right in here too. And close it. And it had like a little fountain like right here in the middle. So yes, some of my favorite toys. Alright, so I'm going to just look at that and watch some movies and then after that I'm probably going to go to sleep because it's, you know, getting late, so. Yeah, but before I go, I want to show you all my pictures, my Polaroid pictures, and I'll show you all right now. And here are all the Polaroid pictures. They came out so nice. I 
and also I wrote on there 24 hours living in the 90s challenge and I have the, today's date oh my goodness I love them so much this is so pretty I'm definitely going to keep this in my memory box so you know I have them in there and I can always look back at them also here's my letter I wrote to all my sparkles my subscribers and I'll read it to you I put on here this little note and I put love you stars and clouds and this is what it says my subscribers aka my sparkles thank you for all your support I love filming videos for all my sparkles filming this video definitely brings back memories thank you for allowing me to share my memories with you thank you for letting me live out my YouTube dreams love Zama Sparkle 92 aka Zama Dwarf I have my little clouds and smiley face right here. And you know, there's today's date. So yes, I just want to reach you all this letter I wrote to you. And hope you love this letter because I definitely mean it. Thank you for all the support. And yeah. Okay, so right now I am going to watch some movies. And I definitely enjoy like the VHS tapes. So I'm going to show you my VHS tapes and just like relax and watch them the rest of the night and I, of course I go back and watch some more um play some more of these games on my Game Boy and listen to more music so I just show you my tapes my VHS tapes and here are some of my VHS tapes that I love to watch especially growing up and yes I'm so excited to watch these tonight and just relax and just enjoy watching some of my childhood movies I love watching. Okay, so right now I am going to watch some movies before I go to sleep. And here is one of them. I watch the Amazing Adventures American Ashley. And yeah, so it's like one of my favorites. Um, growing up. And also, I'm going to watch as many VHS that I can. I'm just going to watch some movies until I go to sleep. And here is my VCR. Yes, I'm so excited. Also, on the other side, let me show you. There's a DVD player. But here's our VCR. Okay, so now I'm going to watch some movies. Okay, so now I'm just going to finish watching my movies and just relax, and I will see you all tomorrow, and we'll finish out the video. All right, good night, everyone. All right, love y'all. I am now finished with the 24-hour challenge. I had so much fun. I'm so happy I finished the challenge. Can you see me now? <laughs> no, I can't see you, Mom. Good. Don't you remind? It reminds me from the commercial, Mom. I take me a little nap till you finish. Mom, you know we're recording, right? <laughs> Bloopers. I didn't know they were so here. Yeah, I had to press the record button. <laughs>